welcome back to my channel so I just finished getting ready for the day and I'm actually at school right now but I just finished packing all my stuff up because I'm gonna head home for the weekend I'm all done with classes for the week even though it's only Wednesday I only have class Monday Tuesday Wednesday which is nice I had my last class for the week earlier this morning that I think I showed so I'm gonna finish packing all my stuff up and getting my room together and then I'm gonna head home So I just got home a little bit ago and I had a package from Princess Polly. So I just opened it up. I don't have too many things. I think I only got three things. Oh, here it is. So I only got a couple things. So I got this. I think this is like a bracelet. Oh no, this is an anklet. So these are like three separate little anklets and you don't have to wear them together. You can wear them separately. So I thought these were cute. And then this is like a little romper, like one of the long sleeve rompers with the buttons in the front. And then this is a swimsuit, which I'm really excited to try on. I hope everything fits, so I'll open everything up. I'll open the bathing suit first. I really only placed an order on Princess Polly because I wanted this bathing suit. And it's like one of those triangle bikinis and then it like wraps around your whole body. And it said they only had two left in my size, so I just ordered it right away. So this is the top. Oh, the straps are like all tied up in the front. I think it's gonna be super complicated to put on. Okay, I'm still trying to untangle this top with all these straps. It's all tangled right now, so I'll figure that out in a little bit. And then these are the bottoms. They just tie on each side. And then I hope this little jumpsuit or this um, romper fits me because they didn't have a size zero. They only had a size two. So it might be a little bit long on me. So this is what it looks like. Yeah, I feel like this is definitely gonna be long. I got this because it looked like a really thin material and I thought this would be good to wear under or to wear over top of like a bathing suit or something in the summer. And these types of rompers are really in right now. So I'll just have to try it on to see if it fits. It might be just a little long in the length, but we'll see. And then this is the little anklet set. So they're just like gold little chains. I probably won't wear this chunky one too much just because this one's like a little big and it has like a little lock on it. I like it and it's cute, but maybe I can wear it as like a bracelet or something. I just liked these ones. These ones are a little more like dainty and this one's just like a basic chain and then this one has rhinestones on it. So these are really cute. So it's definitely not as big as I thought it would be. The only thing that's really long are the arms right here but that's not a big deal i can just roll them up like that if i stretched the shorts like all the way down it would be kind of long but i can kind of just scrunch it and it'll make it shorter and it looks a little weird right here because i have the bathing suit on underneath this just because it is pretty see-through i thought it would be pretty see-through because you could kind of tell on the website but the only way i would really ever wear this is with a bathing suit anyway but it's a super soft material and it's really lightweight and then it has buttons going down so you can button it like all the way up to here if you wanted to but i kind of like it open a little bit so i just pulled this down so you could see the top of the bathing suit but the bathing suit is really cute and it fits perfect so it just like crosses all the way around your body and you could tie it in the front or you could tie it in the back i tied it in the back right here just because i didn't want like a big bow in the front so i just tied it in the back but i really like it it fits really well and then the bottoms are just like plain black tie bikini bottoms and i like when bathing suits tie on the side because then you can like make them tighter or looser so that's always nice This package just came and I'm super excited. I ordered another essential sweatshirt. These can be really hard to get sometimes, so you have to go on the website like right when you drop. And this was from the winter collection, I think, so I just ordered another sweatshirt.
And it always comes in like such nice packaging. Here, let me move this. Yeah, it always comes in like really nice bags that zip on the top. Bow. And I can't remember the name of the color that I got. I think it was called cement or something. So I'm thinking it's gonna be like a gray color. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It's really, really cute. I couldn't really tell what color this was on the website because I'm pretty sure that it was called cement. So I thought it was gonna be like a dark gray color, but it kind of has like a greenish army green tint to it. The one that I really wanted was sold out because they sell out so fast, but I still like this one. It's really cute. And I got this in a size small, I think. Yeah, this isn't a size small. I have some essential sweatshirts that are that are in a size medium, but I feel like those are too big for me because they are a little bit oversized. So I'm five foot and the small fits me perfect. He's so cute. He always just walks away from me. Okay, so I'm about to put some makeup on right now, but first I wanted to show some makeup products that I just got recently that I've really been loving. So my favorite thing that I got is the Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter. Sorry, this angle's kind of weird. This isn't like a new product or anything, but I recently just got this and I've been using it almost every single day. I really love it. So this is like what the applicator looks like. And it's not really like a highlighter. I just put it on before I do my foundation or I think I like even wearing it more when I'm not wearing makeup because it just looks really good on its own. But this is what the applicator looks like. And I kind of just put this everywhere. Like I put this on the high points of my cheeks, a little bit on my forehead and on my nose and on my chin. And it just makes your skin look really good. So I've been using this all the time. And they have a bunch of different shades too. I got the shade Too Light. And I'm also wearing my new sweatshirt that I just got. I'm obsessed with essential sweatshirts. They're just so cute and they're so soft on the inside. So then the next thing is this Hourglass Vanish Airbrush Concealer. And this is like a super small version because I wasn't sure if I was going to like this. So they had like a little sample version. This was like $15 or something, which is kind of ridiculous. This is so small. I'm probably going to go through this so fast. But I just wanted to get a small one to make sure I liked it. And I actually have the full size version of this one. Let me see if I can find it. Yeah, I have the full size version of this concealer, but this shade is just like not my shade at all. So every time I used it, I just didn't like how it looked. It's the shade Fawn. And then this is the shade Cotton. So I didn't know if I didn't like this concealer because of the shade or because of the formula. So I wanted to try it out in my actual shade to see if I liked it. And I actually do really like this one. So I'll probably end up getting the full size version of this one. This one was like too yellow or something or too dark, but the shade cotton is a really good shade for me. And then the next thing is just this little NARS blush. I love getting like sample size versions of everything like this just so I can try the product out before I actually buy it because these NARS blushes are kind of expensive. So I just got the mini version of this one and I feel like I don't go through blushes very fast. So this will probably actually last me a pretty long time. And it's in the shade Orgasm. I wanted the Orgasm X, I think it is, but they were sold out of it. So I just got Orgasm and I've never tried it before. I actually might have tried this like a really long time ago, but I just wanted to try it again to see if I liked it. Um, I like how there's like a shimmer in it because I like having a shimmery blush. So this one's really pretty and I've been using it all the time. So the last thing that I got is the Hourglass Veil Soft Focus Setting Spray. And I've wanted to get this for such a long time, but it's kind of expensive. And I love the Morphe Setting Spray so much that I usually don't switch up my setting sprays. So I finally got this one and I've actually been really loving it. I've been using it more than the Morphe one. I like how it's like a really fine mist and it doesn't leave your face like super wet after you finish your makeup. And the Morphe one does have a really fine mist too, but I feel like I've just been reaching for this one more and I just really like it. So I'm gonna put some makeup on now. I'm not gonna film it or anything just because I think sometime this weekend I wanna do like my everyday makeup routine. So hopefully I'll be able to post that like sometime next week maybe. So I just put on a little makeup and now I think I'm gonna run and pick up lunch somewhere. So I'm gonna end this video off here. I'll have everything that I got from Princess Polly linked down below in the description box. So make sure you're subscribed to my channel if you're not already and turn on the notification bell so you get a notification every time I post a new video.